Let's take a look at John Cena from Mattel's main event series, 148. To the channel today we're checking out John Cena who just recently announced his retirement plans for 2025 so he's going to work through this entire year all the way up into Wrestlemania and that'll probably be it John Cena will be bowing out and passing the torch so Never was the biggest John Cena fan. I did appreciate him. I enjoyed watching him. Don't know if I rooted for him a whole lot, but um, I still appreciated what he did. Great worker, great physique, great size, good mic skills. He had it all, really. And just a guy that come up and, you know, looking at him when he first came up, you thought, this guy's not going to make it. But, man, he sure turned it into something. But... This is going to be my first John Cena opening and my first main event opening, which is the previous basic series, I guess. So they have now turned it over to main event series from just basic series. So here he is, and this is main event series 148 John Cena. Got the hat, the shirt, and the long the jorts owner if you will but yeah excited to get this open and see what's going on the back a great great picture of john cena there with this exact get up on and it says john cena signature move attitude adjustment and he is a powerhouse it says so right there yes it does got the hologram up here the authentic hologram and a cross sell, which we have Hulk Hogan, which we have not opened yet on the channel, but I do have Carmelo Hayes. I've heard of him, but I don't know if I've ever seen him wrestle. Rowdy Roddy Piper, of course, one of my favorite wrestlers of all time. And then Caden Carter. So take Caden Carter and Carmelo Hayes out of there. I will not be opening those two, I can guarantee it, but it will be Hulk Hogan and Rowdy Roddy Piper, whatever I do get them. But yeah. I, I normally open these up the side right here, but I thought maybe if I cut the bottom out, I can pull it out the bottom and leave everything else. So I might try that. Need our knife here. And let's see, I guess I'll poke in right here, come all the way around and come up to there. I don't know. We're gonna see. Will it come out this way? Oh, I don't know. Yeah, we got them. and not too not too bad there so there it is hopefully I can pull him up and pop him back in there I think I will I think you do yeah might be the new way to open the basics here or the main event series but yeah empty package set that to the side there he is John Cena yes We'll go ahead. Don't look like he's tied in anywhere. We'll go ahead and pull him out. I'm excited. First John Cena. Empty plastic. And here he is. We'll go through this articulation. Not sure if it's any different than the basic series, but it, we got head up, down. Uh, no left or right. Head will go all the way around. Head is removable. So if you have another John Cena head, you can... Pop it on here. Unfortunately, I don't. My first John Cena action figure. Shoulder all the way around. Single butterfly. Go way back on him. Looks good. We have single jointed pinless elbows. Yes. Hands will go up. Hand will go down. Hand will go all the way around. And they are removable as well. We have no ab crunch. Waist goes all the way around. He has 
leg up and leg not back so well and he does have big splits so not good straddles slightly we have oh my goodness tight tight knees and they look pinless i believe they are pinless and then the ankles on him actually look awesome now they are not don't believe they will go all the way around, but they're not going side to side, and he will not be able to pair wet. But the ankles actually look great on him for Mattel WWE figures. Those are about the best ankles you can get. So, let's check him out. Face sculpt. Looks like John Cena to me. Hat says never give up. He's got kind of a grin on there. A grin we're used to him putting out the sleeves on his shirt are painted on and this is kind of the basic series i know it's called main event now but as you can see that sleeve there i'm not crazy about how that shoulder's just painted down to that bicep i mean from a distance it looks all right but when you get up it don't look great wristbands you can't see me wristbands and don't believe these are removed. Oh, they are removable. So you can't see me. Wristbands are removable. Got to take the hand off to take that off. That's pretty cool. Let's see if the left hand does as well. Yes, it does. So that's a nice surprise. Wristbands do remove. Like it. Good job. And he's got the jorts on, nothing on them, just kind of a darker blue shorts, black knee pads. I like that the knee pads are sculpted on, not painted on. And the shoes, black tennis shoes, so looks good. Looks like he's going to come down. It would have been nice to get a microphone with him, but not complaining. He is a basic, a basic main event style character respect on his shirt got a guy doing some squats is that john cena squat and i don't think yeah it is that's john cena so it looks good i like him a lot pretty happy with it yeah i would say if you're a john cena fan i would i i don't like i mentioned i don't have any other john cena figures so i'm not a great judge at the john cena stage right now but i saw him with him announcing his uh retirement i said man i want to get it it's 11 dollars in ohio and i saw it and i grabbed it and i'm pretty happy about it looks good john cena can he do it yes yep because with those single single jointed elbows that allows them wrists to go all the way around that's great check it out now there is a split on this t-shirt down the back it kind of looks like if you was to get a knife and get in there you might be able to pry it off but it would if you got that off it'd look silly because then you'd be left with this painted on sleeves there shirt sleeves so yeah john cena Go out and get it. Why not? 11 bucks. That's going to be it. Till next time. Oh, yeah.